Good morning. Good mornings. What's going on, everybody? We are back with another episode of GTA, The Ballad of Gay Tony. This will be episode four. Uh, last episode, we got into a decent amount of things. Um, I know for sure that um, we had helped his um his friends out with something that they needed done. We got AB in the motherfucking building. Happy motherfucking Tuesday, bro. Appreciate you for pulling up, man. Yeah, I'm just now getting getting in. I'm trying to get all set up and everything now, bro. I'm I'm almost there, man. I was falling behind a little bit, man. I ain't going to lie. Um But yeah, you know, that last the last episode of this that we had played, we got a decent amount of progress and stuff. But uh you know, I just I don't I didn't I, like I was saying before, I don't think it's no um it's no end game in sight or nothing, nothing like that. You know, I think we probably maybe about 40, 50 percent. If that, you know, we might not we might not even be 40, 50 percent, you know. Um, I'm always here, brother, either lurking or talking. You good, man. Oh, yeah, for sure, bro. You already know. You know. Um, trying to make sure I had everything uh squared away. I think we good to go, though. Um, we might not be getting audio yet, though. I don't know. We had to get in here. Here we go. Should be getting audio now. Yeah, but man, hopefully you having a good Tuesday, bro. Got to get my, um, I was late getting my tea. That thumbnail Lewis getting his top blown. It's crazy. <laughs> hey, hopefully I don't get flagged for that shit, bro. I was saying that while I was putting it together. I'm like, man, this look fire. But then I'm saying to myself, I'm like, man, you know how YouTube is. They gonna fuck around and flag this shit. I'm like, man, fuck it, whatever, man. I can't, can't keep holding myself back, man. Because I don't want to get in trouble and, you know, get a spanking and shit. I'm tired of holding back, bro. Fuck that, AB. Dropping shit. And then my channel for adults, man. I don't know how many times I keep saying that. Like, this is an adult channel, bro. This channel wasn't made for children. You know. Now, if you, you know, if you're mature enough to come hang out, then, you know, hey, it is what it is. Still haven't slept, man. My sleeping routine messed up. Damn, bro. What side? What, what side of the world you from, bro? Where you from? AB. All right, let's get to it. Yeah, I don't. I don't think I ever asked you where you was from, AB. All right, so what do we got? Let's make our way to him then. Hopefully he got something going on. You from Florida? Oh, that's what's up. My little brother from Florida. Yeah, man. You got to get you some motherfucking sleep, bro. Stay cool, yo. It's just a bike I'm taking. But. Hold on. That shouldn't be too, too loud. Hold on, let me see. Yeah, that might be a little loud. Bring that down a little bit. But yeah, uh, I know how I beat up, bro. Shit. My sleep pattern been fucked up for a minute now. You know, so I could dig that. My shit all fucked up. And it's been like that for a couple of years, for real. I hardly ever really get any sleep. And if I do fall asleep, it's like for a little while. Maybe like a few hours. 
and then I'm right back up. That whole sleeping through the whole night shit, that shit did. Ain't no way in hell, I'm sleeping through the whole night. My motherfucking back beat him, woke me up. I got, um, like, real bad back problems. And, uh, it fucks with me a lot when I'm asleep. Sometimes I, uh, I'll be getting some good sleep. And I just wake up out of nowhere. I have to stand up at least my back. Real fucked up back. Like, I work on cars and shit, but I actually, I don't. I've never worked on a car a day in my life. It's the craziest shit. I mean, I work with a lot of, you know, I did a lot of bullshit jobs, though. A lot of manual labor shit. Factory machine operating shit, so that could be why my back's so fucked up, but I just don't think so. Is they trying to have me get back off the freeway? Oh my god. Time for that tub of bullshit. I could have swore this was the part of town we had got on the freeway at. Or maybe I'm tripping. Probably gonna put like a sensor thing in front of my thumbnail. But it, hey, but if they let you see it, AB, then they gonna let everybody see it though. I just thought about that. I hope they don't trip though. It's art, man. It's a form of expression. It's just art. Oh, yeah, yeah this crazy ass dude. Hey, where's the one man Ben? He's working. Oh, okay. Ray! Hey, Ray! Of company, shut up! Don't tell me to shut up! So, I've heard from some people I know that maybe you have some diamonds for sale. Not me, my boss, Tony. <laughs> oh, my other boss. Yeah, yeah. You got them from the bad cook. Ray! Huh? I'll stay as long as I like. You think you're a big man? Where's your house on Middle Park East? Where's your big sports team, huh? Shut up, you can't! <laughs> Shut up, you fucking can't! Hey, man, is she okay? A big gun makes you a big man, huh? Your thing was tiny, even before the wrestling coach make you take steroids. Mother always <laughs> said she only had daughters. Ignore her, Luis. The diamonds. I, I gotta talk to Tony. You gotta talk to Daddy. I thought I was making you a real man, not a rand boy. Bro, I can't sell what ain't mine, bro. And plus, with all the work I put in for you, I don't really feel like a man yet. Okay. Soon, man, soon. I want you to cover your moves back. He's going to talk to some people. I need you there. Okay, man, I got it. But you should chill out, bro. Let me decide when to chill out. Go! Did this nigga just shoot his own sister? Like, what the hell is wrong with this dude? Like, bro. 
Did you really just shoot through the, through the roof and, and at your sister from downstairs? Like, what the hell was that, bro? This guy is crazy. But anyway, we got two in the chat. I appreciate everybody for falling through on your Tuesday morning, man. Make sure y'all hit those like and subscribe buttons if you haven't already, y'all. Uh. That was pretty cool how he was standing outside the car with his trunk open. That was dope. Yeah, so, um, I'm supposed to be doing another mission for, well, how do you say his name? Bulgarin? Bulgarin? If I'm not mistaken, we did this mission on the last episode of this, but I don't think we ever finished it. Either we, we, we started it and didn't finish it, or we started it and maybe I didn't. I failed or something, and I ended up having to get off off live. Something happened because I remember that cutscene. It's hot as hell, man. Hey, yeah, what's up? I'm here. Uh, yeah, okay. You're in position. Do you see box in front of you? Yeah. Open it. Have you opened it yet? No, give me a sec. No. Okay, I'm here. Shit! I believe you parted with him in a diamond deal. Yo, what the fuck? Is this the guy we bought the ice from? You colluded with him to steal from me. Yo, we just got some rocks off him, okay? Look, listen. No, you listen. I offered you an opportunity, yet you were plotting against me. Yo, I know shit about those rocks. But I believe it doesn't matter. I will do everything in my considerable power to drive you and your faggot master from this earth. Shit. Oh, shit. Fucking great. So, and it's a hit. Oh, yeah. Now nah, I remember. Yeah, this mission was some shit. I got you. Oh, you're so stupid. I never said a word. Oh, shit. Lopez. It's locked. Perfect. Oh, shit.
they can't get on this roof either. Just like I'm locked up here. Shots of some I'm gonna say, I know I'm. the fuck is shooting rocket launchers? Is somebody shooting rocket launchers? Yeah, I know I'm about to say, I know I'm not tripping, man. Yeah, we gonna get from over here. Them niggas, them niggas throwing bombs and all kind of shit. I'm not trying to get stuck with that mission again. But they said leave the area, so I'm guessing that's it. There we go. They didn't really get a good percent with that mission, but whatever. Alright, so we got Tony back on the map. Let's do off of Tony real quick. And then I kind of want to go check out that, that gang, that drug Turn war thing. Left. See what that's about. We already got it. I talked to him about some opportunities. And it turns out the diamonds we bought were stolen off him in the first place. He cut that cook's head off, man. Long story short, he wants us dead. Poor old chef. What were you doing talking to these guys without me, Lou? I'm sorry, man. I fucked up. Kind of refreshing, though, for me to be the one getting us in shit for once. Don't you think? Yeah, a real relief. You have arrived. I'm gonna steal his fucking sports car. Police sitting right there, too. I...
Yank his ass right up out of that. Okay. Read in the chat, man. Appreciate everybody for tuning in. Make sure y'all hit those like and subscribe yes. buttons if you haven't yes. already, y'all. Uh, I appreciate it. Oh, wait a minute, man. We're relatively important people. We're going in, bro. I don't give a fuck who you think you are. You're not coming in. <laughs> he don't never want to let nobody I'm in. I'm a VIP. We, we come here all the time. Hey, Jess. Hey, man. Tony? I ain't seen him. Hey, man. Luis. Bro, can you get us in? Hey, Brucey. Yeah, sure. Uh, Bessie, take care of them. Oh, thanks, oh. man. He's been cool. He's been cool. About to get flagged. I'm going to see some vagina tonight. You walked in with one, bro. What? Never mind, man. Hey, so I'm going to go get the drinks. Okay. Good seeing you guys, man. I got to take care of something. Hey, wait, listen. Can I just say something, man? Listen, can I just say... Roman. What you dealt with, Bori? Pat. I was really great. Thank you. Hey, dog. Uh, don't well, let I you, ain't Pat. That's Bruce. Unless you want me to kill him. Maybe. Hey, listen. You know you're a that's right, you're like a, a lone wolf. An adventure. Tough butt. With a sense of this. Not really, bro. I like killing for money. Yes, yes, I know, but that's just your thing. Nigga, <laughs> <laughs> I like killing for money. What? What's your problem, what? man? Nothing. I didn't mean nothing by it. I'm not gay. It's cool, man. Just don't do it again, hey, man. Hey, look, I fucked three girls last night, man. One of them can't even walk. I mean, now. If she could walk before, she didn't need a wheelchair or anything. Look, I was just checking to make sure you weren't gay, bro. Yo, not a problem, man. I, I gotta go. Hey, listen. Hey, Luis. Come on, man. We gotta go. Let's go. Alright, man. Peace out, bro. Thank God you showed up, bro. What? I never thought seeing you would make things feel more heterosexual. I'm gonna pretend I didn't hear that, sweetheart. <laughs> yeah, probably best. Over to the fish market. Here, 45. What's happening, thing? We're getting Gracie back. She's coming home. You mean taking her back? Or well, this gonna be tranquilo? God, I hope so. They're getting the diamonds for her, so they better behave. Shit. Wait a second. Slow up, man. What have the diamonds got to do with Gracie? What the fuck have we got to do with Gracie? Shouldn't her old man be handling this? Apparently, the kid Didn't members have these asked these already? Us, and we aren't being given much of a choice about it, if you catch my meaning. Oh, great. Andrew I could have sworn we did these missions already. Maniacs. Sounds like another fun day. I swear, it just feels like we did these. Or well, at least that one, um, the one we just completed. I feel like I did that one already. Feel like we did this. We need to get over to Charge Island, Luis. They're expecting us to dock there. No, oh, okay. Well, maybe not. Tony, man. These diamonds. What about them? Yo, man. Abel got his claiming ownership, and he's got some serious resources. Maybe we should think about handing them over to him. We got two options, Lou. Either we give them to the Russian, and Ancelotti kills us, or we give them over to the kidnappers. Gracie lives, and we take our chances with the Russian. All right, man. Sounds like you got everything figured out. I got nothing figured out. 
Half the city wants to kill me, but they'll be lucky if they can get a chance before I die of a heart attack. Easy, though. to bankrupt ourselves. Oh. <sighs> Last chance, D. So you want to hand this stuff over? Sure, I'm sure. Father's gonna kill us if we don't. Yeah, it makes it nice and simple. <laughs> yeah, lends a lot of clarity to my thinking. Yeah, I swear we did this. Gracie, you all right? Daddy? The bastard didn't hurt you, did they? She can't speak. We got a gag in her mouth. Give her back, you animals. She suffered enough. Hand over the stuff. Hand over Gracie. I'm here for you, sweetie. Hand over the fucking stuff. All right, calm down. Both of you. Oh, yeah. We put the ice in the middle. We walk back. Then... You send over the girl. We leave, and you pick up the stuff. Entiende? Sure. Show us the goods. Come back to me, honey. <laughs> Let her go. <laughs> what did he say? Hopefully we don't get stuck on this low screen. He should be alright though. Gracie back safe and sound, Tom. 
I hope she was worth two mil. You hit her, right? She had a voting accident. Make sure her old man understands that. I don't want to see her again. Okay, sailor. So long. <laughs> Damn, we ain't getting none of that either. Hey, oh, what the fuck I gotta do to please a motherfucker? Shit, he pushing up. Louise pushing up on a hundred thousand. Let's check out that drug war thing. I kind of, I'm going to see what that's like. Hello? I haven't seen that yet. Don't. Fuck, Lou, have you heard? That our lives are falling apart? No, yes, no, uh, sort of. The city's closed down the clubs. You serious? Those motherfuckers. All this fucking bullshit and we forgot to pay off the Citadel. Shit, P. Maybe this is a good thing. At least we can concentrate on getting off every gangster's hit list. We better do it quick. There's no more money coming in. It's only gonna get worse for us. Fuck me, I need some blow. <laughs> Come on, I wanna get out of here before I'm fifty. Yeah, so well, I'm probably about to be keeping it cool now. Since they didn't shut the damn clubs down. Yeah, I might have to borrow this. So, yeah, let's go check this out. In 800 yards, turn right. Rocco. Luis Lopez. What could you possibly have to say that I'd want to hear, Rocco? Time to face the facts, Jack. Frankly, you fucked. There's a rich Russian having a powwow with the old man about you and the fag. FYI, they ain't talking about handing you a special commendation. But well, what the fuck are me and Tho supposed to do about that? Let's leave the homo out of this for a minute. Meet me and Uncle Vincenzo in the public toilets in Middle Park. We gotta talk in person. Ah, shit. Change of plans. In 800 yards, turn left. All right, so we're going to go see Rocco. We was close to the Rocco than we was to the gang worship anyway. In 100 yards, turn right. In 200 yards, turn left. Listen, man, I told you. I didn't know shit about who won them diamonds. Then maybe you should have asked. Instead, you ran around the city making a fool of me. You and your psychic boss will be killed for this. I will do everything in my shit. power to... I think the scene was dropping, man. Later, bro. <laughs> yeah, so now he want to kill us. Please proceed to highlighted route. Calculating route. Oh, douchebag. Calculating route. They will burn you if you're careful. That's what I told him. That shit would never have happened back in the day. <laughs> What's up, ladies? Still living the high life, I see. Fuck you. What you doing here, cruising? <laughs> Very funny. <laughs> you know, Mr. Ancelotti still blaming all that diamond shit for Gracie's kidnap? Well, you did bring the heat down on the club, so I can understand why they blame you. Yeah, and those chinks, they're still fucking pissed at that dispute of ours. Again, fair enough. Whatever, it don't matter, all right? What matters is the Russian has come to Mr. Ancelotti and said he wants the head of anyone involved with the diamonds. Now, on top of all that, 
Gracie and chink shit, the old man is pissed. He wants blood. I think we can cut a deal. We give him one body, all right? So basically, it's you or Tony. One of you has to die. Me and Vince would prefer to work with you and the clubs over the faggot, so you're lucky. You kill Tony, you get to keep the clubs. You and us together, partners. Either that, or the Russian is gonna send some serious people round to whack you and the fag with Ancelotti's sanction. Yeah, you both get whacked. You're way out of your league, kid. And you, you're a fucking loser hanging out with children living a fantasy life. I ain't killing Tony, but I may be about to kill you two fucks, though. Then you're a dead man. You and your family and those spick drug dealers you hang out with, you're all dead. It's your choice. It ain't our fault. Fuck you. Think about it. I'll be in touch, you fucking spick. Uh oh. Those are some serious threats. See how that turns out. I'd like three half portions of this and a full one of that. So my car is gone. <clears throat> that kind of stuff. <laughs> Where you want to go, Can I crash into those way. airbags? Don't play with the windows. out of here Whew. it's fucking burning up man Okay, here we are, Bucko. That's for that long ass taxi ride. Stuff got weird with Tony, Des. There's some really bad shit that might be about to happen in there. Okay, boss, I'll be in the security room if you need me. Or at least the club not open. There he is. Thank God you got here, Luis. These, these fucking guys. I talk to them. Tell them we can figure it out. It ain't that simple, Tom. Sure it is. We got money coming. We can expand, refurb, rebrand. I'm an earner. I'm a survivor. I've been in this game since 1987. Ouch. The terrible irony. You better tell them. Tony, man. What? Things are kind of fucked, man. These guys, man. These fucking guys. You never should have brought them in, man. Now somebody's got it. You know. The mix is with us now. You gotta be fucking kidding me. Times change, Tony. Your brand of charming homosexuality. It's be knowing a motherfucking steam. building. Someone Happy Tuesday, bro. It's gone down. Just came home from a party. <laughs> oh yeah. That's what's up, bro. Do it. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, man. Hopefully you have fun, bro. Oh, Sorry, T. You. You was family, man. But it's either you or all of us. 
The Russians are coming, man. We don't got time for this gay shit. Fucking pop him already. He ain't gonna shoot Tommy. What? You fucking moron! Hey, I had second thoughts, man. You fucking killed yourself just then. There's Russians, fucking everyone, they're coming after you. The old man, you're fucking dead. The both of you, they're coming any second and they're expecting corpses. We better not disappoint then. Ah, keep your head, Lou. He's a made guy. Fuck him. All right, get out of here, Rocco. What? This is for the old man and that's it. You're a dead man, Taco. Get out of my club, you fucking mook. <laughs> you sure that was smart? a lot of racial slurs You're not shooting me with smart. I don't think so. Uh, all right. We're going to operate. We're going to need some, some goodwill here. What now? I don't know. Didn't you he know say the Russians the are coming? Building. Doesn't stop, does it? You had a whole bunch of drinks. Oh, shit. Oh, so it's going down. Oh, they coming in this bitch. Could be hitting. <laughs> what kind of vodka y'all have, bro? But y'all had that, uh. What's that, uh. What's that vodka, my brother, like? That, uh. What is it? Start with a T. T. That T. That Tito's. Is it that Tito? Y'all fuck with that Tito? Where you going, man? I'm going to oh, that great goose. Oh, shit. I ain't heard that name in a minute. That great goose. Hey, sister. That goose get him loose. That used to be my shit. That great yeah. goose. All right, so let's get a better spot. This spot not bad, but they're still able to get behind me. You know how yes. much that paintwork costs, you assholes. I need some help, man. Ah, damn! I mixed it with whiskey. 
damn. Four in the letter of the day. God damn. So you mix the vodka, the uh, the goose with some whiskey? Man, you gonna be busted. Man, we got four in the chat. Happy Tuesday, everybody. I appreciate you guys for tuning in, man. Make sure if y'all haven't hit them like and subscribe buttons, y'all. Show. All right, let's go grab a vest real quick. Instead of doing that over and over and over and over and over and over and over. <laughs> That's what it is, though. We need us a vest. We need us a vest and probably some more ammo. I'm thinking some, um, another rifle, some more rifle ammo. Cause do we even? Yeah, I mean we got a little bit, but I think that um, what were y'all calling it? That P90 or whatever it is that he has, the one that Louise has. I think it's cool, but for like one at a time. Yourself, you staying out of trouble, man? You better believe it, bro. Totally. Yeah, why does that make me think you're about to ask me to do some dumb shit? Damn, what you <laughs> take me for? I'm a giver, not a taker. I don't need anything from you. I want to make a gift of my car to you. It's a special machine, but, you know, what you have done for me recently is more special. Thanks a lot, bro. You didn't need to do that, though. No, I did. Yeah, there's a little bit of fun for you in the glove compartment. I think you will enjoy it. All right, man. I'll check that out. Yo, and thank you again. Hmm. What, he talking about that gold fucking, um, that gold, that big ass gold car he be driving? But nobody want that thing. What an imbecile. I should have caught a taxi now. I ain't know it was going to be this damn far. Fucking idiot. Luis was running, though. Right. Ray, listen. No, no, not at all. Three. That's how things seem. But trust me, that wasn't my intention. Nah, you're you back now. All right, that's bad, bro. Me, and now I'm going to fight with you. I'm gonna have to you check out that body scan. I've seen a couple people talk about that. Dad, dad, dad! You understand? No. Could you say it again, please? Fuck you! <laughs> I'm still not getting it. What about a third time? Can't. Bye. Let's get that armor. Yeah, let's go ahead and cop this motherfucking AR. You're ready yeah, for a fight now, huh? Yeah, five G's. Many sixty off of thirty shots. 
Hundred dollars for thirty shots? That's like way crazy. Jesus. Alright. Let's run that back. So we got some armor. We got some motherfucking uh, some AR ammo. Let's see what we can do. Pull out that big wop. Expressive in the motherfucking then building. To go meet him, boss. It's gotta end What's going on? Happy Tuesday. Yeah, we had to pull out some explosives on them motherfucking ass. That was like our third time on this mission. That was getting a little excessive. But we got it done, though. It's a whole bunch of goodies. Alright, we go. I said, where the fuck Tony at? Take them out, Lou, please! So, oh, fuck. Damn, I can't even walk out the door! <laughs> as soon as I walked out the door, he like, bloom! So what the fuck? I don't know. What the fuck, you know? Fuck, Desi. You serious? Get the fuck out of here. Thank you. Oh, okay. We got that part. More of them are arriving outside. I'll take that. Then we're gonna have to go meet them, boss. It's hey, I'll take time. that better than that whole thing over. Because that whole thing was... I mean, it, that it, it's a lot of waves. You know what I mean? It's a whole lot of waves of this shit. Please, get out there! And that is hard. We gonna get it though. I'm gonna get it, chat. We definitely are gonna complete this for sure. Ha, uh, Vino said he got him a, a muffin this morning. Yes, that you? Muffin oh, on the early run. Tuesday morning. For God's sake, run while you still can. Hell yeah. 
of them are arriving outside. Then we're gonna have to go meet him, boss. It's gotta end sometime. Shit, Lou, I'm not built to handle these fucks. Load up, load up. Yo, boss. I think we clear out here. Come out. Fuck. Fuck with Luis. Five in the chat, man. Happy motherfucker too. We got crew boy in the motherfucker bill. A couple of goons? The guys who wanted us dead. Happy Tuesday, bro. I'm done. I'm packing. Six in the chat. Appreciate everybody for tuning in, man. Happy Tuesday, everybody. Hey, make sure if y'all haven't hit them like and subscribe buttons, man. I appreciate it, y'all. Crew boy, how your motherfucking Tuesday going, bro? What did you say? What did what did that say? Ah, uh, should I have saw that? Damn, I probably just fucked that up. All right, we got use here. And then we got Tony. That's, yeah, we close to the Tony. Let's go check Tony out. We taking that bike. That motherfucker is nice. Pretty chill, pretty chill. That's what's going on, bro. Same here, man. One of them laid back mornings. Departure time. <laughs> hey, Tony and Evans getting drunk. Fuck off, Luis. Hi, your mirror. Have we been through this already? Been through the fact that you wanted to kill me? Been through the fact that you're far from alone <laughs> that desire? This is over. It's over. I just want to go someplace far away from here and quietly wait to die. I lived it. I lived it hard, and now I'm ready to end it. Oh, shut up, you hysterical fucking queen. Get a grip, bro. Oh, yes. Silly me. <laughs> Silly fucking me. <laughs> the Russian mob want me dead. My best friend just contemplated murdering me. The mob are on my case. I'm massively in debt, and I just lost two million dollars worth of diamonds. Any other man would just dust himself off and carry on. Look, uh, okay, I'm sorry I thought about killing you. I really am. But if you ah, bullshit, poor Rio got the sniffies. Fuck off, Luis. No, you fuck sniffies off, in the chat. I, I wanted to. <laughs> why? Because you've become a useless junkie fuck. That's why. But I didn't. And now it's you and me. Sniffies in the okay? chat. If your brain ain't working right, then I'll make the decision for us. I'm all right though, man. You got him or us, or you can shoot us both and make his life easy for him. Damn, expressive too. Uh... You're kind of clever, aren't you? I only hired you because I thought you were dumb. Yeah, thank you very much. Yeah, yeah. Thank you very much. Are you coming now? Yes, I'm coming now. Well, let's go. Come on. Says that he's taking on a big heroin shipment at Funland on Firefly Island. Hey, uh, motherfucker. So, say we find him, what are we gonna do then? We're gonna take out their income stream. 
then we're gonna take them out. End this bullshit. Okay, I'm armed, I'm dangerous, let's fucking do this! <laughs> Come on, T, give me a break. What? We're in this together! Tony, bro, I love you, but I should handle this alone. I don't want you getting yourself killed. Then you're gonna have to punch me out again, Lou. Don't make me, man. You know you're just gonna slow me down, bro, and kill us both. I want at least one of us to survive. Lou? Look, T, don't go home. Don't go to the clubs. Don't uh -oh. go nowhere anyone might conceivably think. Brother, look at the There aren't many places like that left in the city, I'm afraid. Come on. Where do you think you can hide that no one would expect? I have no fucking clue. Uh, Dukes? I ran away from there when I was a kid, and I swore blind I'd never go back, apart from to catch a plane. Okay, cool. Damn. Hit up, like, uh, that monoglow monument thing in Meadows Park. Hang out for a few hours. If I survive this shit, I'll find you. If I don't show, then I'm gone. Move to Brazil. Move somewhere. You'll never look back, T. I thought I was the annoying drama queen in this pairing. I'm serious, T. This is my last testament. Yo, send some money to my mom sometimes. And tell her I love her. Okay, Lou, shit. You'll be fine. Shit. No one in this whole crazy town is crazy enough to take you down. <laughs> Shit, Lou, look after yourself. Oh, so it's these directions? Now we own junk trade in Liberty. Anyone need package, they must deal with us. Destroy the heroin. This rainbow got his smack, oh, motherfuckers. Shit. Where is he? I want you. Ah, come on. Drug, fucks. The hell, I should have got help before I came here. I really didn't have a chance to. to. What is that noise?
motherfucker. <laughs> you are all mine. Oh. Fuck did this mission mean? Oh, now, pretty boy. You are too late to get it. Fuck you. You think he will forget about you? You and all your friends are dead. Yeah, that ain't happening, Timmy. Enjoy killing your whole family. Two in the chest. Fuck your pussy. I don't know what the hell this shit meant. Luis, what's happening? I can't talk, bro. Shit's really coming apart. What do you mean? Let me help you out. There ain't nothing you can do, Yusuf. If this crazy Russian fuck manages to leave the country, it's over for me and Tom. I gotta get down the Deuce Expressway without any number of Russian assassins taking me down. Or well, we're done. Why am I even saying this? Wish me luck, bro. by fire. I heard you were here, man. Nah, you said, this fight, yo, listen. Shit, you see.
motherfucker. Got them lock on missile launchers on that bed. Hell no. Nah. Luis doing Mission Impossible type shit. Hey, no, nah, Yusuf came through though. He needed that help. But Luis just did some Mission Impossible type shit. No, we're kind of Ethan Hunt. Ethan Hunt. Oh, this one. Oh, Fuck, I'm dead. No, I was gonna come back to finish things with you. Fuck. I don't understand, like, um. Why did he do? Why did he come from up off of cover? Like I had cover on the side of that chair. Like why did he lift up? What the fuck? That was bullshit. Like, look, he gonna start off and go. Then he just lifts up. Yeah, man, I missed that shot. And that plane blowing up. That was some, some, uh, that was some gangster shit, though. That Louise just did just now. <laughs> that was some shit. He kind of pulled his his uh his parachute a little too early, but 
I guess. Cause like, God damn. But that just shows how big this fucking map is. This map is huge. I don't even think we close to Dukes. I think that's the, the next uh, island up, right? Man, man, we about to be stuck in between train tracks. I'm trying to figure out how I'm about to do this. Why he land on his ass like that? Oh shit. Yeah, get out of this, bro. You just basically ran my whole legs over. Get up. I got you in my sight. Cover me. Could you please step outside the vehicle? Hell no. Pussy Clyde. Calculating route. In two hundred yards. Turn left. In two hundred yards. Turn. We have a ride. Alright, bro. I wonder what the fuck did that mean, though? That mission we just did. <laughs> Thanks. But what all did, what did all that mean that we just did now? Still don't get that. Damn. Shit. So. Oh. Come on, get up. Get up. Okay. Yeah. Thanks. Take care of yourself, okay? Stay away from idiots like me. Fuck you. <laughs> Oh wait. Is them the diamonds? This show the fuck he is. <laughs> you always have to make a scene, yeah, don't you? No. Yeah, I know it's a real problem with me, you know? I wish I was more like you. Subtle, shy, retiring. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, boy. I used to play around here when I was a kid, dreaming of the world, wondering what it was like at that place over there or that little island over there. You ever go that thing? Nah, went to Algonquin instead, waiting for the world to come to me. You did it, man. You did it. You, you saved my life. You, you saved the business. You, you fucking did it. Hey, man, I did what I could, bro. Proud of you, man. Thank you. But I don't want you to get a big head. I don't want you to go uh, change, become a megastar, go to Vinewood, write a blog. Oh, <laughs> you're a pill popping old queen, man. I'm a murdering maniac. But we survive, bro. We survive. We more than survive, amigo. We prosper. 
We took on his town and we won. We took on his place and we gave it the fucking finger. Fuck you all! I don't care what people say. Tony Prince and Luis Lopez could not be stopped. Huh? Oh, jeez. Who's this? What's up, my nigga? <laughs> hey, man. You fucking made it. Man, that was some serious gangster shit. Shoot, shoot, shoot him up. I said shoot, shoot, shoot him up. <laughs> this is stupid as fuck. T, T, give me a hug, give me a hug. Not too close, though. I don't want to give my father the wrong impression. Ah, oh, Luis, I love you, man. I love you. I love you, too. I love everyone. Come on, let's get out of here. Yeah, you used to be saying oh, some by the way, I think my father may be into franchising clubs. <laughs> I know, franchise is not the way to go. The, the club is all about the people. Fuck the people. Fuck them all. Whip out your dick and piss all over them. <laughs> <laughs> but you have to go a long way in hospitality, my friend. <laughs> Okay. The ballad of Gay Tony complete. Nice. That was dope. So what did you guys think of the ballad of Gay Tony? I think it was pretty cool. Yeah, we got about, um, we got about what, about three or four episodes out of this? And it's just a DLC, you know? Hell yeah, crew boy. I think, I think it was dope too, you know? I, uh, um, I kind of wish the story, but that's the thing with the, with a DLC, you can't expect the story to be completely different from the original game, you know. Oh yeah, for sure. That's next on the list. Is uh. Finishing uh, Lost and Damn. We definitely got to finish Lost and Damn. We got a bunch of games we got to finish, y'all. Uh. We got to finish Lost and Damn. <sighs> Fucking Remnant 2. Fucking Jesus. Uh, we got some. We've been knocking out games, though. You're right, though. We've been knocking games out. But we, 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 finished, uh, we finished the Evil Within, what, last week? I'm be honest here, it's funnier playing this than watching it. Right, right, right. I never uh played these. I always used to see them and shit. Like, I, I think I'm at a... You know what? I think I played a little bit of Battle of the Gates only. But I never really had a chance to play Lost and Damn, so... Playing Lost and Damn is pretty cool. Yeah, the Evil Within was fire as hell. That Evil Within shit was really dope. I didn't even expect that to be that fire like that, but that shit... That shit was really dope. Yeah, that was my first time actually playing all the way through, um, uh, all the way play through, through, um, Ballad of the Gay Tony, yeah. That was my first time actually completing the whole story, and then it'll be the same with, um, with Lost and Damn. that'll be my first all the way play through of Lost and Damn. So we'll definitely, we'll definitely, you know finish up that loss in a damn I don't know about tomorrow though I don't think we're gonna do that tomorrow 
I know uh, I had a couple other games that I was, you know, thinking about bringing in, but I didn't know how everybody would feel about them. I mean, it's more Grand Theft Auto. It seemed like everybody loved them some Grand Theft Auto. We still got two more Grand Theft Autos that we could, that's kind of like easing their way to the channel. Oh, uh, Expressive say, uh, stay to K2 tomorrow. Is that what's, that's what's on the agenda? Stay to K2 for tomorrow? Yeah, GTA is always dope, you know, especially when you got a, you know, you got a fresh playthrough, you know, you starting from the beginning and, you know, you able to get that fucking, that initial story going. Yeah, they did. They, uh, I think it's, what is it? Update 36, crew boy? I think it's update 36. They updated the, um. The uh, state of the K two. Yeah, yeah. Update update thirty six. Yeah, so we definitely we can we could definitely. I mean, we could do that tomorrow for sure. Y'all know I'm always down to play some state of the K two. Always, that's like. That's like a, a love, you know, like I really like that game, you know. That's another one. That's a game like I can't really help but like it. But then sometimes I could, it could put me in situations to where I'll be ready to fucking punch a goddamn hole through my monitor, you know. Yeah, they still updating Steady Decay 2. Undead Labs, man. They still updating that shit, man. I heard it's like a, um, like a, I think they call it like a way of life um, update to where like it just helps. I know one thing for sure. I heard that um, they it's it's a patch to where now if you're out and you got a rut set, you don't have to take it all the way back to base. If you if you see one of your output, like if you if you're around one of your outposts and you find a rut set. You could deposit your rut sack into your outpost because you know before before the update rut sacks couldn't be deposited into outposts i think everything else could like or anything else you had on you like you know guns ammo whatever anything you had on your on your in your inventory could go into your outpost but if you had a rut sack on your back it wouldn't do it so with the update 36 now you could take you if you got a rut sack on your back you could deposit that into the um you know your outpost quality of life update right right yeah so like i said y'all know i'm always down to play some fucking state of decay man i just thought that'd be focused you know making a third game you know what i think they is i think they folk they they you know they working on the third one but you know there's so many other big games that's coming out right now the you know, they probably just like, fuck it, you know, we'll just keep throwing out. You know, I mean, it's, it's, that's still money. You know what I mean? They still making bread off that shit. So it's like, fuck it, you know, or at least that's what I would think, you know? Yeah. They, I forget what they said. It was, it's like a group of people that they hired to just work on state of decay updates. Or some shit like that. It was something like that. It's like a developing team that they got now that just works specifically on updating State of Decay 2. So I think they were the same people that came up with the uh the curveball shit. Yeah, State of Decay 3 would be fired. Yeah, hell yeah, hell yeah, hell yeah. They keep it fresh. They 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 basically trying to keep State of Decay fresh. Trying to keep that shit fresh and until the the uh the you know the three drop. But you know, basically the same like with, with GTA five. GTA five, every time you look up, they got a fucking a DLC for, for GTA five. 
I think I just seen something on YouTube. They just came out with another one for GTA 5, didn't they? Like some kind of little mode or something now that they got. Hell yeah. Still playing that too. Yeah, it's a lot of people playing um, Steady Decay. Uh, I mean, um, GTA 5. A lot of people still playing GTA 5. You'll be surprised how many people log on to those GTA 5 servers every fucking day. Right, right. Absolutely. Fucking uh, Undead Labs. You know, that's like a, a little small team compared to Rockstar. You know. But I wouldn't, I wouldn't compare <laughs> Undead Labs to Rockstar at all. So about not getting left for that three. Oh, me too. I've been bad about that shit. Never getting no left for that three. They dropped the ball on that shit. Fucking Valve. I really, really wish they would have, you know, would at least uh. Like I said, it ain't that I didn't like Back for Blood. It's just. It wasn't, you know, it just wasn't there. I wasn't feeling it. Especially, like, if, if they were trying to take that and um and use that as a way to, like, market it like a Left 4 Dead, I guess. But it's like, nah, I don't think, I don't think that Back for Blood was supposed to be uh, a, a Left 4 Dead, you know, a part of the Left 4 Dead franchise, rather. I don't think back. that's what Back for Blood was for. You know, I think Back for Blood was was supposed to be Back for Blood. It's its own game. You know, they shouldn't have added those cards yet. I, I think that for sure, for sure. I think that that whole card system on Back for Blood was was a little much. And then especially, and then my thing is with shit like that, if you're gonna add stuff like that, it gotta be beneficial. It makes sense, like. When I when I played Back for Blood and I was using the cards, I didn't really see like the actual effect of it and, and the benefits of using the cards or the the you know the cons of using the cards. You know, like I didn't I, I just I just didn't see it. It just seemed like some extra shit just to add just to add it. You know, Stardew Valley. Shit, Stardew Valley? No, I don't think I ever heard of Stardew Valley. I'm gonna have to check that out. Stardew Valley. Yeah, I don't think I ever heard of that. Is it a farm life? Is it a farm life game? Oh yeah. I ain't played no shit like that in a while. Yeah, I ain't played no game like this in a fat ass minute. That's like a... What did that remind me of? That remind me of like the old the uh the old Mario the old Mario um not Mario, the old Pokemon games. Yeah, that's what I was just about to say. That's what it looked like. It looked like Pokemon, but for um, farm life. Yeah. I used to fuck with the farm games. Yeah, yeah. I used to fuck with the mobile. The, I, I used to mess with the, um, the, uh, the mobile farm games. I ain't never, you know, I've never played them on PC or nothing or on console. Yeah, I'm a, me too on my phone.
trying to think what the fuck should we do should we go ahead and wrap it up here or I don't know I know for sure definitely tomorrow we uh since that since that sound like the plan everybody talking about that steady decay I think we'll just get in some steady decay tomorrow <laughs> I deserve it. <laughs> Be con being being consistent. Yeah, hell yeah. I'm trying to, man. Trying to. Shit. I know, uh I gotta get better with my game selection. You know what I'm saying? Like I just I just I just feel like my game selection could be a little better. My game palette. I feel like my game palette is is not where I wanted it, at, you know. I feel like it's other, it's other, other games I should be touching. I just don't know which one. I just don't, you know what I'm saying. I don't know what games we should be playing. Yeah. They got some good shit coming out though. So my tear in the motherfucking building. What's going on? What's going on, bro? You could add some newer ones and just shoot it one or two. Yeah, for sure. That's what. That's that's the plan for sure. Definitely. Got to play Elden Ring. Yeah, a lot of people keep telling me about Elden Ring, man. Game of the year game. Damn. I have to check that out then. I know, uh, I know your ass had me get that motherfucking, um, that dead soul, and that was like, the, that's like one of the hardest games to play in the world and shit. I was talking to my cousin, my cousin, like, man, that game hard as fuck. <laughs> I'm like, <laughs> I'm like, yeah, I'm like, I, I, he heard, he heard about me playing, because I was telling him, um, all the games that I be playing on the channel and shit, and I was telling him, I, you know, I, I played Dark Souls, he's like, oh, man. He like man, that game. He like it's cool, but he, he like he don't like. He basically said the same thing I said. He don't like the fact that if you die, you gotta start all everything you did all the way back over. Yeah, Dark Souls is bullshit, man. Dark Souls, Dark Souls suck. Hey, now like, like I always say though, you know, if a if a bunch if a bunch of y'all collectively was like dark souls oh i got to do we got to do i got to do what i got to do you know you know that's what i always say like with the games if it's a, if it's a big a, a big majority of everybody that want to see a specific thing then it's like oh well fuck it to be honest i don't like those games it's crazy the gaming community all collectively agree it's one of the best games of all time yeah, you know, and that's that's cool, you know. That's um you know that's that's like pick your poison type shit. You know. It's all on the you know, everybody everybody have like their own specific type of games that they like, you know. Some people some people like those kind of, you know, what you call them, RPGs. I forget what you call them. Some people really like RPGs. Some people really like first-person shooters. Some people, you know what I'm saying? Some people don't like zombies. Some people like zombies. You know what I mean? Like, some people don't like uh, uh, survival games. You know. Some people love, you got some people that like crafting games. Some people don't like crafting. Like, me, me truth be told, I'm not really a big, big fan of crafting. But it's okay. You know, I'll, I'll play it. Especially if it's if it's 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 um it's somewhere in the realm of what I like to play, you know. Call of Duty is boring, but I like to play a lot. Of play. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, you was talking about that that uh that Black Ops Two. I want to say I think Black Ops Two. You was talking about the one where they uh 
they ride around on the on the bus. You gotta ride around on the bus, got gathering your perks and shit. Yeah, on the bus. Like I'll sue, yep. That's that's the one. That's basically the same one. That's the same one, Groove Boy. I think that's the one she talking about right now, the one with the zombies. Yep, I think that was the last Call of Duty I really played all like that. It was Black Ops 2. I mean, like, playing it to where we playing multiplayer and we prestiging and shit and, you know, ranking up all our guns and shit. Like, that was the last time I really was on it, like, that tough. Back when I was really, really into um, um, competitive multiplayer. Like, I really used to be, I used to be in the competitive multiplayer all like that. Like, I, I was playing, if not six, five to six games of Call of Duty every day. It's cool, man. You don't got to play Dark Souls. There are plenty of other channels that, that got me on that. Oh, yeah, for sure, for sure. Yeah, hell yeah. Hell yeah. Get a controller to play a game. Right, right. I'll probably end up checking it out again eventually, though, Vino, because I pay for it, you know. That's the thing with me. When I spend my money on shit, I want to try to get a little bit of my money out of it. So, you know, I'll, pro I'll probably end up doing an episode of it one day. Oh, yeah, we also, you know, we doing those now, too, you know, on um when I can actually get me some time away from the, you know, not streaming and not working and shit. I like I come down here and, and knock out a couple pre-recorded videos. You know, that's how that's how I was trying to roll out the uh, the other the other Grand Theft Autos. So I got this thing now to where um, I'm doing pre-records and you know if if a bunch of people check out the pre-records and we can get ten likes on a pre-recorded video that we don't really go live with that much. We get ten likes on it. We we'll do it. We'll do a live, uh, uh, you know, a live episode. So that's kind of what I'm trying to get into now. Trying to be, you know, just to be a little bit more interactive. You know, little bit, have a little bit more options for everybody. That way, you know, we able to you able to pick a little more. Especially that's why, especially for games that we had like like how you said, you know, it's you know. For games that we might have played once or twice or two, three times, and then we never played it, you know, a while after that, get you know, that's what the pre-recorded videos is for. I'm gonna be, you know, kind of like trying to catch up on games that we ain't we haven't finished, and then uh, if we could get enough, you know, ten likes or better on them, then we could go ahead and make a you know a live episode of it. So that GTA you got um, pre-recorded with the soldier is dope. Yeah, that um, what's that uh, Vice City Stories. You know what I'm late, guys. Happy Tuesday. See, so in the motherfucking building. Happy Tuesday, bro. Nah, it's cool. It's cool, bro. Yup, all of those. <laughs> all of those, you know, basically all of those. And I had, and you know what was fucked up, you know, I had an episode of that Resident Evil too, where I um um I got far as fuck too. Like I, I ain't mean I ain't mean to get that far, but I know I got far. Like I uh I mixed the chemicals, I got out of the bait, I got out of that 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 part right there where the uh where the fucking um what was that out of the little grow the little grow area and shit. I got out of there. I mixed the chemicals, got out of there. Then um what the fuck happened? I ended up um uh, I ended up going to back to the top of the um to the landing part. You know where they had where they had like the three the three areas where you could go in. I ended up back up there. But before I could get out of there, the what's his name? The dude with the fucking hat? The big the big cocky ass dude. No, yeah, no, I that's what I was about to say, Espresso. <laughs> 
the big motherfucker with the hat, he popped up out of nowhere and, sw- and swung on me and shit. And then, uh, damn, what the fuck happened? Ended up finding it. Did I find it? Yeah, I found. I found the. Uh, I found the fucking um, the the T virus. And then when I found it, the lady that was trying to keep me from uh, remember it was the remember the, the doctor lady that was trying to keep me from getting it. She ended up helping us to uh to to take out the fucking um the big monster dude the big monster dude with the, with the crazy ass arms and the eyes on his arms and shit. He popped out again. So he popped out again. And he got the whoop in my fucking ass. I'm not gonna lie to you. Like, he got the whoop in my ass royally to where it was like, because I was sitting there, like like I said, I, I can explain. At, you know, I was sitting there for like fucking 35, 40, it was, it was like almost 45, going on to an hour. And I looked, I opened up, up, I'm like, hold on, man, let me check. I opened up OBS and I wasn't recording. Now I thought I was though, but I was so because when I looked inside of my uh my um you know the place where all my you know like where all my videos and shit go when I when I record videos and shit, I go into my thing and half uh, I had a little bit of it like maybe like maybe a half an hour worth of gameplay. I had about maybe like a half an hour worth of gameplay of it, but I had sat there and and progressed for like fucking a whole hour and some change so. It was kind of shitty, but, you know, it is what it is. And I just was like, well, what's the point of dropping, you know, 20 minutes worth of gameplay when I got way further than that? So, you know, shit happens. I got to get better with that. You know, that's that's another thing. I don't really do pre-recorded videos much. So, you know, I fucked that up. That was my fault. That's so sad. Resident Evil 2 was kicking your ass and it wasn't recorded. Yeah, he was kicking my ass. Especially once we got to that chemical part. Oh my God. I could not get past that shit for nothing. That shit was really, really stressing me out. I'm like, oh my God, man. Fuck this. I think the chemical I think the chemicals was just as bad as the um what was that? What was it? The door, the doors with the with the chess pieces? Oh my god, that was horrible. I'm like, man, this shit. I'm not playing this shit anymore. <laughs> All right, man, I don't want to play this shit no more. Uh, that's why you started the pre-recorded video. Yeah, that's another reason why I try, I try to get into it more to doing pre That way, I could get better with it. And you know, if you play Elden Ring, you won't finish it until 2026. Oh my God, Jesus Christ. If you play Elden Ring, you won't finish it. Dark Souls kicked you more. Yeah, Dark Souls was whooping my ass. We was just talking about that at Cecil before you came in. Dark Souls was beating my motherfucking ass. I'm not going to lie. I'm like, you know what? <sighs> Turn this shit off. And then, like I said, my cu- my, I, my big cousin, he played video games all like that too. And he even said, when I talked to him about it, he said the same shit. He like, man, I don't like that Dark Souls shit. He like, man, you would get far as fucking get killed and had to start all that shit back up. I'm like, see, that's what I'm saying. Like, I'm like, I'm not feeling that. Like, fuck that. I need me a checkpoint. Dark Souls kicked your ass for four hours straight. Yeah, I'm like, but fuck. Come on, man. Let me get a checkpoint. I'm like, but let me, I'm like, but let me get a checkpoint though. I'm like, damn. I done fought my way all the way from outside to down through the thing. We done went up to the top of the castle. I'm on top. I done made my way to the top of the castle. Like, come on, man. Give me a break. You were in the wrong direction for four hours. Oh, man. That's how, but that's the thing. That's how you know. I'm not really too familiar with those kind of games. With those, um, with the, with the whole Dungeon and Dragon kind of game. You know what I'm saying? I like them, though. You know what I'm saying? It ain't that I don't like them. I'm just not too familiar with them. You know what I'm saying? I'm not too familiar with the whole, you know, those kind of games. You know, but they, like I said, they fire though. It ain't like it ain't like I think it's a trash game or nothing. It ain't that it's trash. It's just I would have that's something I would have to get used to. You know, I had to sit with that shit for a minute and try to get used to it. The combat, the combat was a little different, for sure. The 
combat on, on Dark Souls, shit. That shit was different. I mean, I heard so many stories of people going to the skeletons early. Even up because they got what black you did. No, no, no. Yeah, that's why. That's why I changed directions. That if because remember you said you watched the video of, of the Dark Souls. Those um the the skeletons was the reason why I shifted around and went around. I I tried to get past them and make my way over to the uh to the castle. And then once I got over to the castle and then you know got to other enemies, I was able to see. I'm like, oh okay. And when I started figuring out shit, I'm like, oh all right, well. That's the reason why the skeleton, and then we start figuring that out. Like the, the skeletons, they're not gonna die any fucking way. You know, we start figuring that out. Like, yeah, the, the, you know, the skeletons aren't gonna die. They're just gonna keep spawning. You gotta kill that dude that's down there. And that was that. I think that was another part that we never beat. Like, we never beat the guy that was, you know, that that's making the skeletons respawn. So, we never beat the the big ass dude that's on top of the the the, the castle. That's over in the, you know, at the top of the castle to the back. We never beat him. I don't know how the fuck you would beat that dude. What about the uh, the medieval dude that's down there by the steps? That's all up under the thing and shit with his back turned. But if you get too close to his ass, he start coming at you with that sword and shit. He was the most. That dude was on some shit. Uh, yeah, you need holy damage of the skeletons. You need holy damage. But the skeletons will stay dead. See, that's what I'm saying. You don't... How the, how you supposed to know shit like that? You know what I'm saying? You know, you're not gonna... You're not gonna know shit like that which you just put in chat. You're not gonna know shit like that unless you've played Dark Souls or if you've been playing it for a while to where you know, like, oh, okay. There's no need for me to stand here and fight these skeletons because they're not gonna die. You know what I'm saying? And that's what I was doing. I didn't... I'm, I'm blindly coming in. I don't know what's going on. And I'm standing there for like fucking 35, 45 minutes trying to fight these skeletons. And they just basically just standing out there kicking my fucking ass for a whole hour, you know? So. But it wasn't bad, you know? Like I said, it, it, it's not a bad game, you know? It's just, like I said, it's, that's that's something I would have to sit with and and get, you know, get more comfortable with it. But, man, we got six in the chat, man. I really appreciate everybody coming to hang out, man. Happy fucking Tuesday, you guys. Before you go, make sure you guys hit those like and subscribe buttons if you haven't already. I really appreciate it. Um, Tomorrow is Wednesday. So... I think that's what we doing for tomorrow, you guys. I think we I think we gonna play a uh, state state of decay too. We're gonna try out that try out that new update 36, see see how beneficial that is. Check the patch notes out and shit and see, you know, see what they added and see if maybe we could try out what they added. See if it really helps or not, you know. <laughs> you hungry? <laughs> yeah, me too, man. I think that's what I'm gonna go ahead and get in, get me, uh, get myself into. Get a little bite to eat. So, yeah, man. I really appreciate everybody for stopping through. You know, um, happy Tuesday. Like I said, um, make sure you guys have a dope Tuesday evening, dope Tuesday afternoon, and I will see you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching. See you guys later. Peace out, y'all.